Okay guys, here's my review of the new Campbell's Chunky lineup, sponsored by Mama's Boy, Richard Sherman. First of all, I'm going to start with the best one. This is the pub style chicken, pot pie. It's the best out of the whole lineup. It's creamy, uh, tastes like the inside of a pot pie. It's got some dumplings in it, and it's edible. It's actually one that's really good. Then, next off, you get the jazzy jambalaya with the chicken, sausage, and ham. It's got a little bit of spice to it, not hot. Uh, it's similar to their chicken, uh, I think it's a roast, uh, grilled chicken and sausage gumbo. Uh, it's actually decent. It's edible. And then I got this one here is a sausage and pepper rigatoni. Now that one there, uh, I got it on closeout at Walmart, 50 cents a can, so I bought a few cans. But the only problem with it is that it's like eating spaghetti sauce out of a jar. And um, the sausage of it is supposed to be Italian sausage, but it has no uh, anise flavor to it at all. But I'm going to save that can there back. I already ate one can. I'm going to save this can here back and uh, make up about a quarter pound of pasta and throw it on that. But I don't know if you guys can find that or not anymore. Then next up, this was the biggest disappointment for me. This is the beer and cheese with the beef and bacon. Eh. Now see, it don't even taste like beer. And I don't know what kind of cheese they use in it, but it has a real sour taste. It's just, it, you know, it ain't bitter like beer is. It's just sour. I think it's the cheese. Um, but the beef in it is like beef jerky, and the bacon's like bacon bits. It was the biggest disappointment that I had. And like I said, a lot of people reviewed this before. I mean, check out their reviews and see what they think about it. I'm not going to waste time and review these. Uh, let's go on to the next one here. This is the Mushroom Swiss Burger. This stuff is horrid. It does not taste like Swiss cheese at all. It the burger in it is tasteless you can't find mushrooms and it has this aftertaste that I couldn't get out of my mouth for like three hours it's just it's a horrible it's a bad soup but I gotta give Campbell's credit because what they did was they they're gonna refund me on these two soups they do stand behind their product if you're dissatisfied with them give them a call and they'll refund your money alright Thanks for watching. That's a quick overview of these. Like I said, I'm not going to review them. They ain't really worth a review. So let me know what you think. Comment. Uh, tell me what you think about them. Enjoy. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.